on the last episode of Let's Play Oblivion. Ball Z. I really don't like this guy. What? Oh, fuck off! Hey, he just saved my life. And I think that does it. Cock sandwiches on a goddamn Sunday fucking morning. I have to finish this Let's Play. I've been putting it off far too long. Let's just get this done. Dead people everywhere. Gotta get out of Kavach first. Hit this guy in the balls, and we're out of here. What is it, citizen? Hey, it's the archer guy! The guy who doesn't Trouble. fear anything. Tell me some Truth rumors. Is, the Legion doesn't know who was behind the Emperor's murder. I do. We've already ruled out the Dark Brotherhood. So is this something worse? <laughs> Obviously, or else Carry it wouldn't on. be a game. You know, video games always have to have some crazy plot twist. Well, at least in plot-based games. Okay, so that's probably the last time we'll ever see that soldier archer guy again. And he's pretty cool. He's my favorite NPC so far. And there's that crappy horse. And instead of fast traveling everywhere, I decided, you know what, let's just try this horse. I've never done this before. What the? You cannot turn on this thing. It just it takes way too much effort just to turn. Which is why I'll never be using this horse again. But I might as well, like, for now. Especially to jump down this hill. <laughs> or mountain, rather. Let's just speed this up really quick. Nothing exciting happened. I thought the horse would, like, die if it fell off. It didn't happen, so I guess not. And here, look, 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 look. It's, uh, it's a bandit. You know, it's not one of those stupid, crazy minion demon things anymore. I'm actually fighting a bandit again. Those easy things. God damn it. gonna get away. Oh, of course, the second I put my sword away to go faster, it just stops. Jesus Christ. Oh dear. Ah, uh, never mind. Fuck them. My armor's way too heavy to chase them nowadays. Back in my youth. Oh man. I would've been all over that. Not anymore. Oh god, a wolf. I discovered a camp. Oh god, two wolves. What the hell? Hey, look, there's someone here to help me. Over someone who lives at the camp. Yeah, you kill that wolf with me. Spinny attack. L useless! Useless spinny attack! What about. Why did I do that on a wolf? All it does is disarm people. Wolves do not have arms. And my horse just got set on fire by something. And. What the fuck? Don't attack me! I was gonna let you live because you helped me kill the wolves, but I guess. Not. Oh god, I'm gonna die. If that fireball didn't hit her, I would have died. And now my horse is taking care of shit over there, so I can just stand back and heal. Yeah, you get him, horse. Look at that, my horse is kicking his ass. Might as well help, though. Yeah, see? And here we go at the camp. Let's loot up the place. There's a bed I'll be using in a few seconds. <gasps> Locked chest! If I, <laughs> I don't have any lockpicks. Damn it, 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 damn it. Let's go. I'm bored. I'm bored. This camp is boring. Let's go to this big ruin over here. Hopefully there's something like worth a fuck. Probably not because all these ruins there are just like side dungeons which I probably shouldn't be doing because I just want to get this let's play done for God's sakes. At least the, the main storyline. And I think there's something here. Yeah, there's a goblin. Yay, weak stuff. Ow. Well, I have, I have, like, no fatigue. Well, I have a ton of fatigue. I think that's what that means. Why is it a... I don't get that. If the bar is low, that means you have no fatigue. But that means you're tired. If the bar is full, that means you have a lot of fatigue, but you're, like, as energetic as hell. Fix the bar system! It's obsolete in video games. Bars don't... It shouldn't exist anymore. Let's try the spinny attack. Hey, look, it actually disarmed him. That's interesting. That barely ever happens to me. Scales. Who wants those? What does this guy have? Ooh, a lock pick! Yes, I can go back to that chest now! And I can prove to you that I can pick locks. Even though that one I believe was very easy, but. God damn it, look at this. Watch, watch me. Oh, wait, hold on. Yes! I did it. And a lion's pelt was inside the chest. That was worth it completely. 
I'm an idiot. Okay, let's go back to that tower thing. Where is it? There's the entrance. Is this it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. I'm gonna get another pick, lock, luck pick. And I'm gonna pick a lock that um, is not very easy and actually has stuff in it. You mark my words. Mark my words. Here we are. It's all dark, and I don't want to equip a torch because it looks stupid. I just like walking around without a weapon out. Damn, looks bloody in here. What's that guy doing? What the f- Someone got dragged by their bloody hands. Ha! Shield. You like my shield, don't you? My heavy armor still increased. Yes, I can level up. I'll do that later. I want to figure out what's in here for lockpick, yes! I need to collect more of these. I'll put them in my ass. So I'm gonna sneak up to these guys, and I read in the comments in one of my earlier Let's Plays that you're supposed to take off your boots, but you know what, screw it, I'm gonna take off all of my clothes so I won't be so heavy, and I won't uh, fire a bullet. I'm gonna keep the ring on though. So let's sneak up to these faggots and get a sneak attack for once. <laughs> the only logical way to get a sneak attack is to do it completely naked. There's a ghoul in there. He's mine. Once I figure out his movement patterns, which is the point of being a stealthy stealth. Oh, here we go. Let's go a little quicker here. My sneak skill increased, which... Will it help me here? Will it help me? It fucking goddammit! I hate you ghouls so much. I'm gonna fight you naked. Screw it. Um, oh crap, my sword broke. Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna pimp slap you. This is how we do it in the ghetto! Yeah! Hand to hand skill increase. <laughs> no shit. Swords break too easily. I'm not even rough on them. I don't use them for anything besides fighting, really. Let's see if I can sneak attack or anything else. Um, I think I just aggro that guy, and he's gonna probably aggro the whole place if I know anything from WoW, so I'm getting the fuck out of here. Just put my stuff back on. And... Yeah, okay, that's locked. I'm not gonna risk it. Let's just get out of here. Run like the pussy you are, Slapper. Uh, let's just... Let's go back. Let's, let's continue the story, finally. I'm bored with this... Cannot fast travel on enemies nearby. There are no enemies nearby. There are none. Not one. Not a single enemy. But I still can't do it. Let's just run away here. Oh, there's a wolf, but no miles away. Can I go now? Nope. Uh, do I have to kill everything within the three mile radius just to fast travel? That's stupid. Where's my horse? Where's my horse? Can I fast travel now? Nope, there's still people nearby. Because that thing is all yellow. I can't even wait when there's enemies nearby. Fuck. Are they gone yet? Are they gone yet? Let's go to this big red thing and see if they're gone when I get over here. What is this? It's like a Diablo 2 ritual stone or something. There's nothing even there. It's an altar and there's nothing even here. Aren't they supposed to have like stuff at the altar, like dead goats? What are the religious people doing in this goddamn game? Okay, so there's no one around anymore, that means I can fast travel. And apparently I can't, so what the fuck, what the fuck, what the fuck? Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay, let's see. I'm just gonna run around and kill the first thing I see. Come back here and I'm gonna try again. I don't see anything. See, there's nothing nearby. Why can't I? Oh, now I can. <sighs> Whatever. Well, <laughs> <laughs> 
in the next video, whenever it comes out, I will be continuing the storyline finally. See you then. Good day. No, there's nothing funny at the end of the video this time. Nothing. Don't feel like it today. Go away.